Welcome to a little day in my life where um, I sprained my ankle and now I have to let my mommy take care of me all day while my husband's at work. This is what my ankle looks like. Okay, great. I'm about to make some matcha. Figure this out. My camera's going dead. Great, 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 great. This week is fabulous. This week is great. This week is um, wonderful. <laughs> Getting ready to go to my mom's house. This is the little outfit. I thought if I'm not going to be moving, I can at least be cute while I film. So stay till the end of the video where I will tell you how it happened. It's an embarrassing story. So you're going to want to listen. Yep. Yep. The battery is a little bit charged. Fit. Check. I'm staying with my mom today because my husband's going to work and I really shouldn't be even doing this by myself, but it's fine. And the swelling has gone down a lot. So I made it to my mommy's house. We've been hanging out. She set up this chair for me. Got my ice pack that I probably need to put on my foot and then she took me to Duncan. I didn't ask for it or anything. She just decided to take me. I got a matcha latte with oat milk. I've got my bag, my laptop, so I can like work on some stuff, but I think right now we're gonna watch some Outer Banks because Outer Banks is my favorite summertime show. We started watching it at 2 p.m. and then she stayed up till midnight. So, watching it. So, we're gonna see um, how far we can get today. I'm taking my fiber supplements, by the way. The new season, I think, comes up next summer. So, I'm getting her into it now. I'm just gonna chill, hang out, relax for a moment. But, ooh, lounge back. Talk to you in a bit. Lazy day. This is currently what my ankle looks like. Oh. Oh my god. It looks worse than it actually feels though, to be honest with you. I'm trying to stay off my foot as much as possible, but it's really hard when I have like always been hyper independent. Having to basically be babysat um, is really hard for me. <laughs> um, don't like it at all. I took some medicine. I haven't taken any medicine today. I probably should. It hurts at the end of the day. like at night when I'm really, really tired, or if I'm like in the car for too long, it starts to like hurt on my knee and stuff. Like it'll hurt going from my ankle all the way up here and then through my toes and stuff. Usually first thing in the morning because I've been asleep all day, like all night, um, and like I've been sleeping just fine. Uh, my mom is bringing us some lunch, so she's treating me today. <laughs> Making sure I'm staying hydrated. I don't know when I'll be able to dance again. I don't know when I'll be able to work out again. Um, I'm hopeful to go back to work next week. Not like work out, get in the gym, but like go teach a class at least. Um, I'll probably have to be still while teaching in class, but I'll, I'll have a brace. Hopefully next week will be fine. I only actually have to teach like one or two days next week, so it should be good. Uh, and then I have like a long weekend because it's 4th of July. I'm gonna go before I get copyrighted because this TV show is on the background. I have not a great foot still. It's pretty jacked up and swollen, but I can like hobble around a little bit. I am losing my mind sitting in a chair for the last basically three days. Did you? Go to your mom's house if you don't
love this stuff. Love, love Briogeo. I don't even know how to say it, but love Briogeo. And I can't remember if I put her onto this or not, but it's a great product. She put me on the scent bird. I do know that. The one that I got this month smells like white diamonds. And I'm not necessarily a fan of that. Oh, I gave her this because I didn't like it. <laughs> um, but I think she likes it. Self-esteem beauty sleep serum. Have you ever used this before? Is it good? All my weight is on my like left foot. <laughs> so my right foot's just kind of hanging out. Um, but she's still very swollen and my left foot has taken most of my weight this past couple days. <sighs> Girl, she's struggling. So much vitamin C serum. So many, so much skin and makeup products. Look at this, look at this. This woman has everything, everything. Kind of obsessed, kind of obsessed. This is where I get it from, ladies and gentlemen. Um, because my mom has all the makeup, all the skincare, all the perfume, all the hair. Show. <laughs> I'm tired of sitting down. Where's Cleo? On the boat with them, I think. Yeah, but well, they don't know where she is. And then my husband got off work, came and got me, and we headed home. My foot was really hurting by this point, so I was just not feeling it when I got home, and I I went straight to bed. All right, friends, I came home. My ankle really hurts. I don't know if I'm explaining this right, but it feels like, a, my ankle feels like how a toothache feels, where it's like sharp stabbing, but it's like going from my ankle all the way up to my knee, all the way back down to my toes, and the swelling today has been insane. Look at that, that is like bruising. And now it's like starting to bruise on the other side as well. Fun, 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 fun. Uh -huh. Anyway, I'm tired. I don't feel good. My stomach is hurting. So I'm making some like tea to help with that. <clears throat> I'm gonna keep my foot elevated tonight. Um, I'll see you guys in the morning. Hey boo, it's BB. Here we talk about my dance journey, Taylor Swift amongst other music, and a bunch of my lifestyle stuff that I've got going on. Why don't you go ahead and hit subscribe and then you could be a part of my YouTube fam, which I call my besties. So you can be a bestie from the start if you subscribe now. Love ya, bye. Good morning. It's the next day. Um, I have a few things to do today. Um, like I have an interview that I have to get through um, but for the most part I'm just gonna be hanging out I'm not posting a video today so anyway I have to walk down the stairs and I can't do that with you so to my husband here headed to the mom's house got a pimple patch on right there I got on my little pink Calvin Klein dress with Tommy Hilfiger little cropped sweater. And then I've got on my fake Birkenstocks that I bought from Timu. And then I have my socks for when I get to my mom's house. My feet are a little cold today. 
I just did my hair for my interview today. I'm a guest on the Mentally a Badass podcast, so I haven't done my makeup, but I did do like a cute little slick back bun. Hopefully I won't look too much like an egg on camera. Really been loving this slick back lately, um, but I'm gonna do my makeup really quick and then we're gonna hop on the podcast. Hi, how are you? I am good. Can you hear me okay? My teeth aren't like, <laughs> I don't have everything in my teeth. So I just finished with my interview. I think it went really well. Um, mentally a badass. I don't think it's gonna be up by the time this vlog goes up. I need to stop walking on my foot. Um, I'm like limping around. It'll be up July 6th. You can go listen to it then. I'll have it linked below once it goes live. Me and my mom are gonna finish out the day by just kind of watching some TV. I've been elevating my foot more today. I had it elevated the entire time I was in my interview and all morning, so cool. Um, I also, I'm also just letting my mommy do everything for me because if not, I'm gonna be mad because I can't do anything for myself. So I'm just gonna suck all this in. So tired of sitting still. Because y'all know me, I don't know how to do that. I don't like doing that. It's not my thing to do. I like to be moving around, doing stuff. Pretending that I am a helpless maiden who can't do anything for herself helps. Um, here, Burger King hat to uh, really seal the deal here. Um, anyway, I've got like my foot up behind me. Um, I'm gonna sit down and go find something for me and my mommy to watch. I would like to add, we did watch the entirety of all three seasons of OBX. So now we gotta find something else to watch. <clears throat> Hyper independence is very hindering to my, um, my healing. So I guess I'm gonna have to just give in and let other people take care of me. Wanting to just do things myself, it's just easier if I do it myself. Just who I am, I can't, I can't, no. Because if I want a smoothie and if they make it wrong, I'm gonna be upset because this all could have been avoided if I had just done it myself. Happened to constantly be posted up like this. <sighs> but if I wanna get any better and I wanna be dancing again, at least by just the sooner the better. Um, I think though August is the best bet of when I will actually be able to like fully dance again. Um, I need to I need to stick to my healing and like be for real about it. I am nervous though that um, it's gonna take a lot longer than just to August before I'm fully able to dance again um, because the new season starts in August and I'm really stressed out like for my job, my potential professional career, like everything is kind of on hold right now because I can't work out, I can't train, I can't do anything um, for the rest of the summer practically. Um, I'm hoping I could go work back to work soon, but I do have a physically demanding job, so I don't know. But not thinking about that while I'm trying to romanticize my, my injury. Um, there's nothing cute about being injured, but if it helps me get through feeling helpless, then so be it. 
Besties, this all started the morning that I got my Sabrina Carpenter tickets. I was so happy and so excited, as you can see, jumping around. I'm gonna go see her in Atlanta here. I literally cannot believe it. Um, and then I went to teach my first class of the day and, and I was jumping rope with a hula hoop and I fell and my ankle turned inwards and it popped and it was getting huge. Like you can see in the photo, like it, so big um and it was swelling really really badly so they gave me some ice at the hospital uh and we kept it on ice and then they wrapped it they did some x-rays um and then they just said you know go home rice method i mean look how big that is it's started to bruise around midday on tuesday and then this is wednesday it got much worse that that's thursday night it's much better today as you can see but it still hurts. It's still pretty swollen. I didn't get to go to the beach, and I'm really, really upset about it. <laughs> but anyway, that's the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. Um, stay tuned for more content. Fun, fun, fun holiday, 4th of July. Get ready with me coming on Friday. Mwah.